Hello and welcome back to another episode of War Tales. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our mischievous journey through the Virtus province where we're trying to, yeah, literally survive as a gang of mercenaries. Uh, why would we want to attack you? Oh, we need chains. Okay, so let's get some chains first, which I think we'll get from the jail. So we wanted to attack them because it is one of the storyline missions. We reward anyone who brings in outlaws. Wow, 20 per chain. We've got room to spare. Well, now we got all of the chains. Thank you. Uh, we have no prisoners, so that's not going to uh, matter for us. But I think we need to launder these. It's a pricey find. Go on. You don't know what it's like not to be reelected. You can hire me if you want, but I won't rattle my friends. It's interesting that you can hire someone who is uh, put into prison. There is also a large rock here that I would absolutely love to crush. <clears throat> but yeah, that's potentially something that I will do off screen. Just a huge mining operation to get that going. We got 20 chains. Which, by the way, <coughs> this year, <coughs> sorry, is one of uh, the best inventions. Because you can launder whatever you want <coughs> in there. Good, now that we do have chains, let's start to actually do what we have been tasked, which was attack and ambush that woman. I think that's the caravan, uh, caravan we, we were looking for. Gotta be careful here. <clears throat> Who are you? What do you want from me? All right, let's go, boys. We already wanted six out of six stars. It's not getting any worse. I tell you something else. Uh, we are fighting front to back and not in these like split, stupid um, starting positions. Good, we need to capture her. Fair enough. Namri, Ender Sanders. Yeah, the front line is. Very solid. Daddy G can move up from here and then shoot, which is good. Good, our typical start. Would be something along these lines. Move up. Orderly inspire him. Encourage everyone to take less damage. And then start our nice little melee madness journey. Engage in battle. In mortal combat, as they say. We want to, if possible, hit more than two. 
at the same time. Moving to here would allow that. It still leaves that slot in the middle open. Good friends bonus. Nice hit. And I think we're just going to stay here for the extra valor. There you go. Hits his own friend. Perfect. <clears throat> Moving up. Pushing this guy slightly back, which is needed to allow Grell to come in. And I think this is the right place. Very good. One. Two. Three. <laughs> oh yeah. One, two, three. I uh, could attack again, but i rather s uh, like our battle position. <clears throat> Might as well move to here to not catch fire. That was a quite nice hit as well. Roby engages on this flank. Can handle two. He's a bear at the end of the day. All right, so, uh, there we go. Moves to here. Stabby, stabby. And we're slightly moving back. move up sprints all the way to here oh, that's a bit much I don't want uh, a massive arrow to hit either of my friends so we're just going to stay here for now I think what we're going to do is get everybody inspired, support our bear, and close the front line here. Fortunately, the bear is now burning. Not optimal, but so is everyone, uh, everyone else.
Moving up. Breaking the surrounded here. Getting a nice little extra attack in. And getting us some Valor. Some much needed Valor. This Grell is moving up and is starting to clean house. Oh yeah. Well, the only reason why she couldn't finish him is not enough uh, not enough uh, Valor points. Okay, let's move to here and here. Damn it! I wanted to not be hit. Nah, can't do that. Bear sense in the front line. Uh oh no 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 we're not going to do that she's already burning which is great how can we capture her Okay, now it's just a matter of capturing her, right? Right. Who does a moderate amount of damage? I think the bear. Okay, cool. Bear moves away. And she's stunned. Fantastic. There we go. We captured our first prisoner. Unfortunately, these guard armors are not really that good. Good. We'll continue to do all of the recipes that we can. We definitely need more salt. And she is also eating with us. That is unfortunate.
Reduces by one the number of rests required to restore a precious item. Uh, we got a coin. Cool. I think this was down here, right? No more codices that you can re uh, research. Jim, I became a mercenary to travel the world and slay bandits, not to break stones and cook all day. Well, you could brag about that. You could also increase your relationship, which I think you should do. Inappropriate Murphy, Roby. Well, why, why do you start relationships with animal companions, dude? Oh, I see, because you already like half of the group. This here is a fantastic... Uh, mm, Love triangle. This looks like a hippie community more than anything else. Adores, loves like the core group, with the exception of Zoe, who for some reason doesn't seem to be all that uh, much appreciated. And he even starts liking the animals. Isn't that cute? Civilian might as well sit at the campfire. Uh, we got five clean shackles, which is great. Might as well put all of those and those in here and start laundering them. Might I interest you in my humble wares, my good sirs? Um, matter of fact, I think we'll take all of that brandy. Mainly because we need brandy for those fire immune collars. And they have proven to be incredibly valuable so far. Good, wait. Uh, we can return our quest or we can root out more of these guys. I think we're just going to root out a few more. And then there's another set of enemies over here. Okay, so apparently we need to root out all of the enemies. I coincidentally have I've uh, taken three of these vials, not knowing that that's the exact same uh, exact number that you need. Well, complete surprise, right? That we're going to be engaged. Is that all that? All right. Let's uh, join some fighting, shall we? Very good. Well, these poor fools will soon learn when to not uh, dabble with us. Namri moves in and we're engaging. <clears throat> All right. I like this little uh, triangle, by the way, which always tells you that that's the next one <clears throat> who will take action. It's a neat little graphical user interface update telling you, okay, you don't need to worry about this guy. There is just one archer and we'll take care of them when time comes for now we're inspiring everyone to be quick
And that is not enough room to let anyone through. I suppose this here is a bit better. That way there can at least be one of uh, ours who can like walk through. Engage from the other side. Moves up, triple hit. Good, good stuff. Move up, pushing them a little bit further, <coughs> and we're building our front row. I like that melee combat. It's well done. Sentry gets hit. And put nicely into the fire. Okay, here we go. One, <clears throat> two, three. And a bit more melee combat. Oh, there's a second archer. Okay, never mind. Very good. Continuing over here. Three hits with a poison. And as always, so predictable, they are going for the bear. But Roby has... It's not Roby's first rodeo. He has fought often before. some poison there we go let me check if sprint actually puts out fire yes it does so good of course if you sprint next to a unit that then catches fire, you are... Uh, you cannot be helped anymore. But the core principle is still intact. Sprint gets rid of fire. Such as uh, the axe of JP Pauly uh, gets rid of unwanted idiots. A 
everybody gets that nice little shout bonus and then we're getting Valor back. Well, that indeed was a mistake. Moving back. Very solid kill. And softening this guy up. Okay. Bring it on. I think I'm just going to get those fireproof uh, belt knuckles. It's so annoying that fire spreads and it's continuous hit point damage. And if we're not affected by it, I can use a lot of the fire based skills without any downside. Could literally just spam fire and nothing happens. to be foreseen unfortunately good everybody speeds up moving up and that's it Dilly moves to here Oh, 112 behave. So we finished him nicely. And that might look like a shield which is helpful for us. Powerful counter. When hit by an engaged opponent, this unit retaliates with an attack of opportunity, cannot uh, trigger by an attack of opportunity. Okay, that makes sense. Um, less guard, definitely less armor more of an aggressive shield I think we're going to go with it I like that idea and these fireproof ointments we're going to we're going to build a few more of these anyways let's trade in uh, um, our last quest and then I Might think we're I almost done my humble wares, my good sirs? all right can't steal it but we want to buy it although it is expensive But it's one of those very few moments where we can get iron because we don't have 
we don't have um, a minor. <coughs> I like it though, you get a fair share of all of the traits. Um, and just having the option to, uh, to select um, between all of uh, the different uh, traits is actually quite good. We're legging um, the white leather. I'm just wondering. A ghost pike. Well, we already have a pike, right? Ghost sword would not be a bad idea. One-handed sword. But it requires a little bit more wood. But other than that, it's a good... Like, her sword is really bad. His axe is also quite bad. Hammer is great. He already has an upgrade for that. This is a fantastic dagger. have we got here okay let's hand her over hiring you was the right decision after all this woman was a source of end please accept this reward and the gratitude of the honorable adra alazar family we have gotten ourselves a pristine essence Well, thank you, milady. Is there anything else we can do? No. I like how the handover doesn't feel like we've done something particularly good. Uh, this is a very grayish game in a sense uh, that you're making difficult, very difficult decisions from time to time. So a few things I believe we need to do. In the next episode, we're going to finish the last tubers here. In the meantime, and we also need to finish the runes. And I know that the great hunt is kind of here. Hunt down the pack of uh, virtues. That is not the same as Finner's pack. No, I know that the pack that we're hunting is here. So, um, how about next episode we're starting with the vineyard and then do the hunt. I think that's good enough. That's good for one episode. Not sure if we can do the tomb. But we might start with the tomb and actually do the pack and then the hunt. That looks like a decent order of things. For now, the next order is to end the episode. And I think, thank you very much for watching. If uh, you enjoy the mischievous deeds that we're doing here, consider leaving a like button and uh, leaving a click on the like button and a comment down below. And see you in two days. Bye bye, guys.